PrePercussionLessons.com, working with the vibraphone. Let's talk about what makes up a vibraphone. We have three octaves usually of metal bars set up like a keyboard where you have the um, what would be the naturals, the white notes on a piano. <laughs> down here, and then you have the accidentals, or maybe the black notes on a piano. We also have resonating tubes. We have a dampening bar, and the dampening bar is moved up and down with this pedal down here. Use my foot for that. And it's called a vibraphone because there's a motor you can see the motor here, and if I turn the motor on, that spins these fans in the resonating tubes. So without the motor going, it sounds like this. If I turn the motor on, you get that vibrating sound. Most motors have a variable speed, so you can have a slow vibrato. Or I can speed up at all sorts of different speeds. I can change the speed that way. If you're not using the motor, you have to make sure that the fans are this way, vertical, in the resonating tube, and not this way. When they're this way, they close off the sound. When they're this way, you let more sound out. To use the pedal, I always want to keep weight, the weight of my foot. I just think of using my big toe. I keep the weight of my foot always on the pedal instead instead of letting my foot come off and slapping. So if I'm pedaling, I would play it like that rather than this. That doesn't work very well. So this is the vibraphone. FreePercussionLessons.com. We'll see you later.